Ito ang unang vlog ko na fully Tagalog. Kasi hindi nyo yata alam na Filipino ako eh. Bago yung galit, alam ko na yung blue nasa taas, di ba? <laughs> Tara! Mga Filipino! <laughs> Welcome! <laughs> Pasensi na kayo kung malabi yung Tagalog ko kasi uh, I'm not very good at it. <laughs> The last time na nagpunta ako sa Pilipinas, uh, 13 yata ako, mat mat matagal na man. I am now 36, so mga 22 years na hindi ako nak nakabata sa Pinas. Nandun pa rin yung tatay ko. Nag-migrate ako sa US. I think I was maybe 7 years old. So, dito ako lumaki. Ito lang talagang alam ko. Like, this is all I know. Wala akong alam na history of the Philippines or... Like, if you put me in the Philippines today, <laughs> I wouldn't know how to survive. Hindi ko alam, man. Maybe a lot of you think that I'm American. Pero Filipino ako. Talagang uh, that's where I was born. I was born in uh, Ilocosur. Vegan. That's where my dad still lives and all of his family still lives there too. Well, my family. The rest of my family on his side. Dun sila sa, sa Ilocosur. I was talking to my cousin a couple weeks ago. Sabi niya, <laughs> akala nila, uh, nakalimutan ko na sila. Pero hindi naman ganun eh. I still remember all of them and um, sana makavisit ako sa, sa Pinas on next year. Yun ang plan ako. Tarin ko yung anak ko tsaka yung Uh, asawa ko. They can learn about their culture, the Filipino culture. Something I always wanted to do, pero I don't know. I don't know why I've never done it. Ang hirap talaga magtagal <laughs> at mag motor vlog. Pero sana uh, I get used to doing this so that way I can do more of these para sa inyo. Maraming salamat kung nanonood ka sa Pilipinas or if you're Filipino and you're a follower. I appreciate you. Maraming salamat talaga. It's very rare na kumakain ako ng Filipino food. Kung nandito yung nanay ko, nagbibisit, then, you know, I get to eat Filipino food, pero kung wala siya dito, <laughs> very, very rare. Pag nakikita ko si Jigs or King, si Ray, palayo ko na, no? <laughs> hey, let's go eat some Filipino food, because I don't get that a lot. <laughs> Surprisingly, I don't have a lot of Filipino friends. Hindi ako lumaki ng maraming barkada na Filipino, kasi yung mga Filipino-American dito, Parang ayaw nila sa, sa akin kasi immigrant ako. Hindi ko alam. It, it was just very difficult to make Filipino friends uh, growing up. Hindi kami mayaman. <laughs> Yung nanay ko single parent and she raised me by herself and um, you know a lot of these Filipino Americans they, they have both parents and They're, they're established. I don't know. I just couldn't relate to these Filipino Americans that that had money. And it's crazy because <laughs> my parents are also. It's strange growing up here that way. But I'm daming Mexicano where I'm from, so a, a lot of my culture was relatable to Filipinos. I mean, to Mexicans. So, siempre yung mga barkada ko Mexicano. Cha yung asawa ko Mexicano yan. <laughs> Hindi mo marerealize yung importance of culture hanggang matanda ka na. Especially kung may anak ka na. It's hard because I, I want my kids to know my culture pero I don't I can barely speak the Tagalog. <laughs> Tang ina. <laughs> But I promise uh, susubukan ko. I'm gonna try to learn about my culture as much as I can and hopefully share my life with some of y'all in the Philippines who are kind of wondering like I, I don't know why you guys wonder why I'm Filipino or not kasi di ba yung pangalan ko adobo mo to patapos <laughs> di ba mukha kong Filipino o kaya maybe some of you guys think I, I'm Mexican or some other culture pero hindi 100% Filipino ako hirap nito man <laughs> hirap talaga <laughs> It's crazy because my mom just is the Filipino lady. At saka, ako, I, I feel like I am Filipino-American. My mom's accent never changed. In fact, I feel like I got worse over time. Kung nagsasalita siya ng Tagalog sa akin, nag-respond ako ng English. And over time, my Tagalog just got really, really shitty. I never spoke Tagalog 
ever, really. Not even to my mom. Some of you guys might ask, uh, kung alam ko pa rin mag Ilocano, pero um, basi lang. <laughs> basi lang manang manong. <laughs> that is the extent of my uh, Ilocano these days. May ano dito, store na they sell halo halo. So, of course, yung kabihin ko si Emilio sabi niya we'll get some uh, halo halo or balot <laughs> gustong balot I love balot I love all Filipino food even if I don't get to uh, eat it as often as I would like dito sa bamboo sarado yung um, a normal place I go to pero nakita ko buwas ito so dito tayo kukuha ng halo halo tara Hi, can I, can I get a halo halo? Ah, tignan nyo to. Ooh. <laughs> Salap nyan. Oh my god. Itong totoong halo halo. Oh my god. I went to the other one. The other bamboo in Tacoma. Wow. Itong mas magandang halo halo dito sa Piwala. Okay, this is how you eat halo halo if you're not a Filipino. You take your long ass spoon and you just... You just grab your spoon and move it up and down like this, just like that, <laughs> until it until it mixes eventually, right? Oh my God! Look at that, dude! Golly gee whiz! They got it all in here. I think they got jackfruit in here too. This is the one, bro. This is the hollow hollow to end all hollow hollows. I mean, like you gotta. If your fingers aren't getting wet from you trying to mix it, that's not a hollow hollow, bro. <laughs> this the hollow hollow. Shut up, man. Holy shit. Yup. Yup. I don't hollow hollow. Oh my god. Shut up. My favorite part is the beans. Yung talagang pabrito yung yung beans. <laughs> Mm. So good. I posted this picture on my IG and somebody commented just do the ocho ocho when you introduce yourself to another Filipino next time. Great icebreaker. Hindi ko alam yung ocho ocho. Hindi ko talaga alam yun. I pretended like I knew once pero hindi ko talaga alam ng ocho ocho. So, kung Filipino kayo, you know what the ocho ocho is probably. Let me know. Kasi hindi ko alam kung anong ocho ocho. Ang daki yung halo halo na tops ko. Daming laman. Ang ganda ng panahon. The more I do this, the uh, I think the better I'm gonna be at my Tagalog. Sige, cold start natin to. Oh, sakit yung leg ko. Nag dirt biking kami kapon. Tapos ah, tumakbo ako ng 5k. I don't know if you guys have 5Ks in uh, the Philippines, but uh, yeah, I did a 5K before for this. <laughs> Tara! Oh! I've always wondered what it's like to ride a motorcycle in the Philippines. My traffic lights bahaya done, or is it just like bahala na? Lamang ka kung ko. Panunuuring ko ng mga Filipino na mga vloggers. There is one that I used to follow. I I liked his content before. See, you know, see J Mac, Moto Vlogs. Pero wala akong time na manood ng mga Moto Vloggers. So maybe this is a good excuse so so I can see what it's like to magmotor sa sa Pinas. Always wonder that. Buso also halo halo man. Nangina. Sarap. Wala naman ano Filipino restaurant dito na malapit sana. Punta tayo. <laughs> Next time. Ang ganda talaga ng panahon. My god, yung sun. Sun. What's the uh, anong Tagalog sa sun? Alam ko ang mundo. <laughs> Mundo means world. Pero sun? Ara? Is that? Ah, hindi ko alam. Sana may mga Pilipino tulungan nyo ha. Para 
mas uh, I can get more content out that's Tagalog <laughs> practicing ko nga si ano si Ray si Jake Sir King parang hindi nagtatagalog yun eh <laughs> meron yatang Jollibee na ma-open dito sa Tacoma alam nyo hindi ako big fan ng Jollibee I thought I would like Jollibee more you know being Filipino um pero hindi ako no, uh, mas gusto ko ng kare-kare <laughs> Mas masarap yung karakara sa, sa, sa fried chicken uh, I don't know, I heard Filipinos na mahal na mahal niya ng fried chicken daw Nung bata ako, gustong gusto ko ng fried chicken Pero ngayon, mas gusto ko ng ano, karakara <laughs> Munggo, bagoong Kung ano, any Ilocanos in the house uh, Alam mo yung Sinanglao? That's like my favorite thing man, I love Sinanglao Sinanglao talaga Mm, that is my shit. And I think that's only in like the countryside na my sinanglao. Correct me if I'm wrong. I always wondered kung dun ako uh, lumaki sa Pilipinas kung may passion pa rin ako na magmotor. Hindi ko alam kung popular ng nagmamotor sa Pilipinas. I know motor vloggers daw popular sa Pilipinas pero is motorcycling popular sa Pinas? Hindi ko alam. Taka sa kayo sa, sa Pinas. Um, you know, represent in the comment section. <laughs> I would love to know. Meron nagka-comment noon na hindi nila ako sinusuportahan kasi uh, yung classic kong content creator. Hindi ko alam kung may mga content creator na film na taga US. Nagbebate sila ng Filipino um ano nun? followers? wala kang wala, wala kang pakilam dun <laughs> tanga na <laughs> mag follow kayo ng kahit na sino it's not my uh, tanga na <laughs> hirap magtagalog it's not my uh, not my priority hindi yung priority ko na hopefully I get all these Filipino subscribers I'm just Filipino like that's it <laughs> Oh my god, mm, dramatic yung some taos, some taos. <laughs> I wonder if I still uh, know how to use a tabo. I probably do. Once you use the tabo, you can't unlearn using a tabo. <laughs> Pero sa America, hindi kami nagtatabo, puro just um, toilet paper lang. I know, it's uh, nakakadiri. <laughs> hindi nyo alam, tinanig ko yung Talaria Sting Arco para sa ito yung Husqvarna TC125 motocross bike Tapos, natapos na <laughs> yung pagwa-wash ng bike. Alam ko kung sa Pilipinas ako, 
lumaki, iba talaga yung buhay ko. Baka mas mahirap sa Pilipinas pero mahirap din dito eh. Matanggal na ako dito sa US. Mga 28 years na. Maybe 29. Yung biggest flex ko, I not once did I deny na Pilipino ako. Anyway, yun lang. Thank you.